Welcome to the Irish Rebel Show. Irish is outside throwing out trash. I thought you guys would get a kick at how many birds are at the dump. It's a lot of seagulls, but once in a while you see some uh, vultures, which I think is actually pretty awesome. Come on. Do the thing where y'all start flying around at the same time. Are you guys getting camera shy now? This is what progress looks like. And this is like the smallest dump around. And it's still so bad. Okay, I'll start it up if they start doing the flying around thing that I want them to do. because the truck was coming they were gonna get scared but no just more landed okay there's another truck coming up I'm hoping all the birds there will start going huh hey I'm doing a video for your channel about the dump but I wanted the birds to do that big swoopy bird thing they do Oh, there they go. It's not as impressive as I thought it was going to look. Ooh. There we go. I'm just okay. Go take a look at that auger. Yeah, this dump sells stuff. Once you look this way, it's not so bad. You got your recycling and you can even donate clothes here. You can bring your tires. You can bring your green things you can bring electronics they do try to keep everything separate it's just the stuff that's gross goes where in the big gross pile well let's see how much it is yeah just gotta find a staff member while Irish talks to the big man in the big truck, there's the wood pile. And we hate the fact that you can't scavenge in there for stuff. I understand why safety, blah, blah, blah. And you don't know what people actually throw out. Sometimes they throw out more than wood, but there's some good pieces in there that you could repurpose. What happened? Well, he said 10 bucks. I'm like, fine, you know, I'll pay it. I had a 20 on me. Oh, uh, we could throw some uh, clothes and stuff for donation over there. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so he told me, no, no, I don't have change. I'm like, then how about free? <laughs> He's like, no, how about you go and pay for your dump and then go stand in line and come back and pick it up. And then I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. I got better things to do with my freaking time. Why can't we just pay where we pay for the dump fees? I know, it just doesn't make sense. This is Subri's finest. To be fair though, you're the only one I know who can go to the dump and find something for fishing. Yeah, even though I said, I'm sorry that you didn't get it, but that was ridiculous. So this is the, oh, these are all the uh, yard piles that turn into mulch and stuff and they sell the compost mulchy, yeah, crap. Anyway, so the glamorous life of the farmer when he cleans up his yard and has to bring everything to the dump. Huh? Well, thank, well, it was nice talking to you, everybody. Thank you for doing BBB, and we'll talk to you later. Bye. See, it that helps. was a good one, Frank. The thing is, <laughs> when you get the camera pointed in your face saying nothing and then just looking at you, uh, gotta put you on the spot. So, anyways, thank you for letting me be me. Talk to you later. <laughs> I stand by my tactics. <laughs>